So it's me, your little boy, K. Samson. Wait, let me tell you this. <laughs> they thought they can be blessed like you. <laughs> their thought is that they we can also be blessed like you. <laughs> but they don't know that our God don't do with what with ugly. <laughs> They don't know that the blessing of God don't stay in a ugly and envy, jealous places. Yes, they wish to be blessed. Yes, they deserve to be blessed. But all the reasons and all they thought was that they would take you away and occupy your space. <laughs> but they don't know what God has given to us is for us and it's not for everyone. They don't know that when God bless a man, he don't cost a man. They don't know that when God is with you, no man can be against you. When God says yes in your life, it is final and final full stop. Yes, all their thought is that they will do anything in order for them to take you away and do what and occupy your space. All their thought is that anything they will, they, they will do or envy you, jealous of you, come together and with that, you won't be able to receive the blessing of the Lord. You won't be able to progress nor succeed. You won't be able to do well or excel. This is all they thought. But it really shocked them how you suddenly start to break some record. It really shocked them how you suddenly start to do something that no one have ever done. It really shocked them how you suddenly start to do or to do well even without them. <laughs> yes, all their thought is that uh, uh, we, are, we are going to be blessed like him. But they don't know that God, yes, God can bless them. But they don't know that with that enviness and bitterness in their heart, with that ugly situation, that our God is a God who don't dwell in an ugly place. <laughs> yes, some of them will feel like, well, why, why are you the only one being blessed in this place? Uh, all, all of us deserve to be blessed. Yes, you deserve to be blessed. But God does not care whether you are this or that. What he looks is what your inner mind. So many, many people are frustrated. Many people are devastated because you keep getting blessing despite of the fact that they are against it. Many people are hurt today because all their hope was that you will never be blessed. All their thought was that you will never be, what, be blessed. But they can't just figure out why the Lord keep blessing you. They can't just figure out why God keep favoring you. Why God keep elevating and doing and favoring all you do. And that is the main reason why many of them are really frustrated. Believe me, it really hurt a lot of people because God keep blessing you. And they were expecting to be blessed. They were expecting to take your position. They were expecting to occupy your place. They were expecting to take you out of the way. This is the world we are living. Where people will sit down and be imagining how they can take you away. How they can take that which belongs to you. When they don't know what you have done or did. How many times, how many, how many times you have failed before getting to that place. All they thought is that they can take you away and occupy your place and start enjoy it. But right now it's, it's already hitting them because they are tired of as giving what giving report about your business, about your about your doing. And that is really frustrating and what and terminating some part of them. You know what I'm saying? So remember blessed me, God bless you.